So I read them before Twilight, before the Vampire Diaries. That those were like the OG vampire <laughs> books for millennials. I'm Anna Rimmer with Pop Culture, and today I have Jay August Richards and Janetta Kaiser for Peacock's new show, Vampire Academy. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you. Thank you for having us. <laughs> Now, this is such a fun world to become a part of. Can you tell me a little bit about your favorite part about becoming your characters? If you want to go first, Janetta, you're on my left. Absolutely. So my favorite part about becoming my character is that she spends a lot of time in a library. And I love to read. I love books. I love the smell of books, even if they're old. So that did it for Perfect. me. <laughs> my favorite parts about playing my character are the costumes, because my costumes are amazing they were all <laughs> built from scratch from sonia grande um and then wearing those costumes in places like what you see behind us where we shot yeah. in spain you know we shot in castles and monasteries and churches that are centuries old and wearing those costumes and being in those places just gave a real sense of the scope of the show and the history um so that's what i loved about working on the show that's awesome i mean Fans of Vampire Academy have been waiting for like a really good adaptation for yeah. a long time. Did either of you feel pressure kind of going in to get this right? I'm on their side because I am a fan. I read the book, yeah. so. Oh, that's <laughs> awesome. That's my answer to that. <laughs> no. I agree. I personally felt no pressure because I, I only felt the pressure to represent my character um, properly in terms of how I interpreted him. And so because my character is such an equality activist, that's who I am in real life. So the I just wanted to transfer my feelings about social injustice into this world. And it's so much fun to do in a world of vampires. You got the Royal Maroi, you got the non-Royal Maroi, the Dompiers and the Strigoi, who are the bad vampires. So it was just a fun world to play in. Oh, yeah, absolutely. And Janetta, you, you were a big fan. You read them kind of before you had anything to do with this project, it sounds like. Absolutely. So I read them before Twilight, before The Vampire Diaries. The, the, those were like the OG vampire <laughs> books for mm -hmm. millennials. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I read them when I was young. Oh, my gosh. So this is like a dream come true. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> and I didn't realize it at first when I when I booked this. I was like, Vampire Academy, that sounds so familiar. And then like everything clicked and I was like, oh my gosh, I like must have manifested this or something. Because <laughs> I, this is insane. <laughs> we leaned on her for all the information because she's read all the books. So Right. <laughs> You're the little you're encyclopedia. Right. <laughs> <laughs> right. Oh, that's awesome. Is there anything that you're really excited for the fans to see as they kind of wait eagerly to see what you guys have put together? I'm excited for them to see the Dompier fight scenes mm. because they're so cool. They're so, the, the choreography is amazing. Um, and I, that's when I'm like, I think everyone's just going to love that so much because it's so well done. And I'm excited for them to see the world of the show. Mm -hmm. It's so exciting to see, you know, a world that you've only read about come to life and the places that we shot, the costumes, the props, the world, it's like, I don't think anyone's ever really seen a show like this ever. So that's what I'm excited about. Also seeing the elemental magic. Yes. That's so cool. Ooh. Seeing vampires do magic. Yes. Did you oh, ever yeah. work your magic? Did you? Oh, we can't answer that. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> You're trying to give spoilers here. Right. <laughs> exactly. Well, and, and, and kind of on that note, if you got to take any element of the Vampire Academy world and bring it into your real life, which would you bring in? What 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 powers would you take or, or something like that? In a practical way, mm -hmm. I think I would use air because then oh. I could just push things out of the way, like just mm. push traffic. Like Bruce Almighty just split. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. That's, but spirit is so cool because we don't really mm. know what it is. So that mm. that's the one I would just like, yeah, I would do that one. You know, I one. always loved how vampires just pop up on people. Like, you know how you're watching a vampire, <laughs> any, any vampire genre, vampires just pop up one minute, then gone. Next minute, they're just like, boop. <laughs> I wish I had that power. That's awesome. Well, thank you so much for talking with me today. I can't wait for everyone to see this show. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you.